Hello and welcome to CCIEadvisor.com. In this lesson we will be discussing the NTP update calendar command and what you're going to do with this command is uh, first of all you want to have NTP configured and updated and you want to have that, that configured and, and hard-coded to your iOS on your router switch and if you don't know how to do that you can uh, do a search on CCIEadvisor.com to follow along and, and to do that um, once you've done that, then come back to this lesson and you can see um, with the NTP update calendar command, it will periodically update the hardware clock from the software clock. So your software clock is going to be updated via NTP and the hardware clock, which is also called the calendar, which is the um, which is uh, a battery backup uh, version of, of a clock on some iOS, Cisco iOS devices, will be updated from that. So. NTP will update the software and the software will update the hardware. The hardware will go out to the software and get it from that. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look at that command. And It's not going to show you too much, but uh, just so we've reviewed it and you can see the, uh, the exact syntax is that um, remember the other cl clock update commands are done from the enable mode or the user mode or the privileged mode. Um, or the privileged exec. Um, in this case, <clears throat> it doesn't work as you can see, so what we need to do is go into the con configure terminal mode, and that's where your NTP commands are going to be anyway. Um, here's a bunch of them, and on the bottom there you can see the update calendar command NTP space update dash calendar, and hit return and we've actually done it okay so now we've already done it it didn't give us any results sometimes <clears throat> you're not going to have the um, the console uh, logged with certain commands and so we have done it in this session we've done the NTP update calendar command and we could do a write memory so we'll save it to memory and we're actually done with this command so what we've done here is we've enabled uh, NTP update calendar and we've peri we, what it will do is periodically update the hardware clock from the software clock and um, your software clock is going to be updated from NTP your, um, your NTP um, version of your timestamp will be updated to the hardware clock from the software so thank you for joining us for this lesson on the NTP update calendar uh, command and configuration on CCIEadvisor.com. Thank you.